You know and love him as the Bay Area's beloved clown prince of fools. And now he's returning to Berkeley for a holiday special that's good for the entire family to enjoy. Here to tell us more about Fool La La holiday gift is performer Unique Derek. Unique, thank you so much for joining us today. Oh Ooh la la, thanks for having me. <laughs> yes, we are so excited to mm. get into a sneak peek that you're gonna give us okay. of your live performance in just a bit. But before we get into the entertainment, all mm. the performances, let's talk about you yeah. as a performer. Tell me about your career and how it's expanded the Bay Area and how you've truly become a performing icon here in San well, Francisco. Thank you. thank you. First of all, thank you so much for having me on, yeah. on the show. Um, my career started, I started fooling around in show business with my mother uh, at UC Berkeley. She was studying dramatic arts and I was in plays with her. And that was giving me a little bit of a taste of performing on stage. One day I'm at home in my bedroom pretending to be doing the robot. <laughs> and I had this thing on my head that plugged into the wall. Yeah. A friend of my mother's who's taught clowning by the name of Irina Isaacson, she walked by and saw me doing this thing and thought it was really funny. Mm -hmm. And she told me about uh, her clown classes. I took the clown classes. Um, from there, I joined the Pickle Family Circus. And this is in the early 80s. Yeah. And I learned more of my skill set with the Pickle Family Circus. And then from the Pickle Family Circus to Make a Circus and then going on to find who is unique, Derek. Yeah. Who is my clown? What, you know, bringing my skill set and doing body percussion and just finding my way over these years. And I'm still finding my way yeah. over these years. Aren't we all, though? Yeah. You know, that's mm -hmm. amazing. And you've definitely established yourself mm. as a top performer out here in the Bay Area. Tell us a little bit about Full La La, uh, mm -hmm. this, this entire performance and how people can catch it this holiday season. Yeah. You know, um, Full La La, I came up with the name. You know what, circus, when you go to the circus, you're like, Ooh, wow, oh my God, <laughs> clapping, right? Yeah. So ooh, la la was like my first thought, but then I thought, I always gotta find a way to name it differently. So I thought, fool la la. So the idea is to create a show where it's got the oohs and the ahs and the wows with entertainment through clowning and, and skills. Mm -hmm. And that's how I d developed the idea of fool la la. And every couple of years I try and uh, message something different in the story of the show. This year it's holiday gift, Fu La La holiday gift. I don't want to give away what the gift part is. You got to yeah, come see the show don't, to don't find tell out. Us too much. Um, but that's that's kind of like how it got started, and I just love doing it during this time of the year. Families are looking for something to do. We have a great circus community. You know, there's Circus Bella. There's the San Francisco Circus School which that circus school grew out of the Pickle Family Circus. And I remember teaching there years ago, part of that. So just being part of that circus community, offering entertainment for families after the show, I love to invite the audience to come on stage to learn body percussion called Hambone. And I teach juggling. And so I find myself as kind of an edutainer. Edutainer, I like, I like that. I like to entertain and I like to teach whatever it is that I know how to do and pass it on. Oh, that's beautiful. And so I think that's personally my Fula La holiday gift, passing it on. I love that. That's Thank your you. holiday gift yeah. to us. Yeah. Well, tell us all the details about the show and how people can catch yeah. it this week. Okay. The show will start uh, a week from Wednesday. That's Perfect. December 27th. Next week, okay. Uh, it's only four shows. Usually I do like eight to 10 shows. It's a shorter uh, set of shows. Uh, at the Marsh Berkeley. Um, you can get more information, themarsh.org. Um, you can all, of course, you can follow me, Unique Derek, on Facebook or uh, Linktree, Unique Derek, and get more information. But the Marsh Berkeley in Berkeley, mm -hmm. um, themarsh.org is where you can get all the information about the show. Love that. Mm. Okay, so it's going to be a very entertaining show, and you're actually going to give us a sneak peek mm -hmm. of what people can expect, and maybe teach me a couple of different tricks today. So are you ready? You I'm need ready. Derek? Absolutely. Right, let's head on over. Okay. Okay, here we go. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, are you ready? I'm ready. Okay, first let's just maybe do a little bit of a fun face warm-up that I, just to get in the silly bone. <laughs> Try see if you can just do. Uh, yeah, we'll just loosen up. Good, 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 okay, good. Okay, gotta loosen up. Mm -hmm. Uh huh, uh huh. And then maybe the head go here a little bit, isolating. Yeah, okay. right. Because being, okay. you know, being a clown, you gotta learn how to move your body in funny yeah. ways to uh -huh. get people to laugh okay. with you. Right. <laughs> so one of the things I do in my show, a lot of juggling. Okay. After the show, I teach young kids. I invite the families to come up on stage and learn how to juggle. Okay. And for kids, the best tool is 
juggling scarves. Okay. So I brought a juggling scarf. All right. And what I want you to try and do is just gonna hold it in your hand, throw it across your body, grab it down. Throw it across your body, grab it down. Okay. You're just gonna go back and forth. Here we go. Throwing it across, throw it across your, your body, body and grab, grab it down. down. Throw it across your body, grab, grab it, down. it down. Yep. That's it. Now that's okay. step one. That's step step one. two. Now step two is gonna look like this. Can I borrow that for yes, one second? Please. Step two is you're gonna go, you're gonna throw across, throw across, grab, grab. So okay. you're gonna go throw, <laughs> throw, grab, grab. Okay, throw, I'll do throw, it one more grab, time. grab. Throw, throw. Grab, grab. Okay. This gives you time to process. What am I doing? Throw across go. your body. Throw, throw, grab. Grab, grab. Yes, good. <laughs> that was close. Uh-huh, one. one more. Throw, throw, throw grab, grab. grab. Okay. Excellent. So that's the juggling part. We won't go on to three, because three gets a little bit tricky. A little too tricky for but, your girl. But if, if it's okay with you, yeah. I'd love to show a little bit of body percussion. Please Something do. that I do. So I do ham bone in the show. Uh -huh. And ham bone is an African-American art form of body percussion. Okay. And so the way ham bone works is you're going to pat your thighs. Just get a sound check right here. Good. Sound check. Yep, yep, yep. And then up, up, chest, up here. Uh-huh. Good, good, good. And now the other part is to go back down across your thighs. Let me demonstrate. Please. Hambo, Ooh. hambo, play Ooh. that drum. Hambo, okay. hambo, make it fun. Now, now I'm not going to have you do the full out <laughs> hambo. I'm okay. going to show you something a little easier. Okay. 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 This is um, hand jive. We'll do hand jive. If you can just pat your thigh. One, okay. two, three, four. Yeah, there you go. Good. And now you're just going to go up and down. Bring the other hand on top. Good. I love yeah, this. Yeah, good. Keep that going. And, keep that. And you know what? While we keep this mm -hmm. going. I'm yeah. going to take us to commercial. Yes. But I appreciate that. Yeah. You keep this going. Yeah. You know I got it. We appreciate you so oh, much. Oh, yeah.